Good day everyone, I'm meteorologist Adam Kolpak. We've got a hot forecast coming up in the seven day here in the Rogue Valley. For now though, you can see we basically have mainly fair conditions. There could be a few clouds passing through this evening. However, later tonight and tomorrow morning, we may see some areas of fog, low clouds and patchy drizzle developing, especially along the coast here. You can see on our pinpoint forecast, notice the clouds building into the coast, also into the Illinois Valley, Applegate Valley, and also up towards Douglas County. Some of this may make its way into the Medford area by tomorrow morning. So we could start out with some low clouds, maybe even some patchy fog. We'll see more sunshine though during the day. Saturday looks really nice, especially by the afternoon as we have more sunshine. And Sunday is going to be beautiful as well. We'll have warm to hot temperatures here in the Rogue Valley, our high right around 90 degrees. So it's looking pretty hot, not only on Sunday, but also the first half of the seven day forecast. We'll take a look right now for the coast. Low temperatures generally in the 40s and 50s, mainly fair this evening. But again, low clouds, possibly some fog and patchy drizzle into Saturday morning. More sunshine, though, developing during the day with temperatures generally from the upper 50s through the 60s. We could even see some 70s for highs. I'm going for 49 and 68 for Brookings moving inland. Low temperatures will generally be in the 40s and 50s and highs on Saturday, 70s and 80s, 48 and 81 for Medford, 45, 78 from Mount Shasta City. And again, we could start out with some low clouds during Saturday morning, otherwise mainly sunny. The wind out of the north northwest from 10 to 20 miles per hour. There could be some higher gusts moving east of the Cascades. It'll be cool for you with lows generally in the 30s and 40s. Mainly sunny and nice for Saturday. Going for 36 and 74 for Klamath Falls, 34 and 76 for Alturas. All right, grab the sunscreen again. You're going to need it here in the seven day. We go from 81 on Saturday, 90 on Sunday. The record high is 96 at the airport in Medford, set back in 2001. The other records on Monday and Tuesday were also set back in 2001. Go for 96 hot degrees on Monday. The record is 100. 95 is the record high for Tuesday. I'm going for 97, so that would mean a new record high at the airport in Medford on Tuesday. There is a chance for some afternoon and evening showers and storms on Wednesday. Also a chance for scattered showers on Thursday as we cool down into late next week. Klamath Basin, you'll have highs in the 70s, then 80s Monday and Tuesday. Plenty of sunshine. There will be some clouds mixing in at times. There's a chance for some afternoon and evening showers and storms on Wednesday and scattered showers and thunderstorms possible on Thursday as you cool down later next week. Mount Shasta City, beautiful on Saturday, 78, 84 Sunday, around 90 or so Monday and Tuesday. A chance for some scattered afternoon and evening showers and storms Wednesday and also a chance on Thursday as you cool down into late next week. For the coast, maybe you're heading there this weekend. I have temperatures generally in the 50s and 60s on Saturday. Could start out with some low clouds, maybe some patchy drizzle, otherwise more sunshine developing during the day. With the Chetco effect, there's a possibility here Sunday and Monday around Brookings and Harbor. Even though I have highs generally in the 60s and 70s, some areas may even be warmer on Sunday and Monday afternoon. We start to cool down a little bit more into next week with highs back into the 50s and 60s by the latter half of next week.